its contagious speed is that of lightning, making humans sick and dropping like flies. The ERs are full of it. Homes are no longer safe. It got frontline workers exhausted instead of exhausted. Heads of state and government in awe, citizens in denial, dismay, shocked and confused. Even the popes are speechless. Is this the end of the human race? Hugs are the new abnormal. Clubs and disco are prohibited. Indoors is the new normal. Schools are suspended. It got us all tired and terrified, wired and petrified. Economy is hit hard by it. Domestic violence at its peak, student pregnancies blossoming, dreams shattered and scattered, millions of jobs lost. Daily bread is no longer earned. It caught us off guard, laying low and very unprepared. But look, the sun is shining bright again. And again, the human race has won. As the vaccines are now available, few are lured to them. Many remain unbothered, the youth especially. You say you don't trust them? You say it's the white man's scheme to white blacks? You turn into a zombie when you get one, so you say? But brethren, lest you forget that you once received polio and measles jabs when you were very little, why did you not die then? But brethren, lest you forget you once received polio and measles jabs when you were very little, why did you not die then? And the millions of lives of others who received it not worthy than yours? It's patriotic and love all together, getting safe and protecting each other. The more we make a healthier choice, the more we worry about the human race. Get in line, get jab. If it's not for you, do it for us.